Come on, let me take you to dinner. Dinner is not going to fix this mess. Yeah, I was counting on the margaritas to do the heavy lifting. This is not what I signed up for. I need to get some help in here. Well, so do it. Great, I'm taking Georgie. Georgie, no, he's my best employee. He's my grandson. Well, so what? Sheldon's a smart one. Take him. Do you want to go out with somebody who's happy and fun or some cranky old woman who smells like mop? All right, all right. Take Georgie. Thank you. I'm going to go get myself fixed up. I think you look beautiful just the way you are. Go to hell. OK. You fancy yourself a bit of an entrepreneur, don't you? I like to think so. And now that you're not in school anymore, I bet you're wanting to take your career to the next level. What kind of entrepreneur would I be if I didn't? Well, this is your lucky day because I have quite the opportunity. How would you like to manage a business all on your own? That'd be amazing. Be your own boss. Call the shots. Hell yeah. What is it? Managing a laundromat. No way. The place is wall-to-wall -wall girls. Why didn't you lead with that? My brother went to the laundromat, excited to meet the female customer base my Meemaw had promised. You said girls. They were girls once. Not in this century. Come with me. A secret casino room? Yeah. The cops shut me down. That is so cool. This is not how I saw this playing out. Hey, you took a shot. That's impressive. I guess. I mean, most folks your age have someone cutting up their food. That's enough. Well, I still think you're a badass. <laughs> Thank you. 67 years old, scraping Tootsie Roll out of a clothes dryer. Hey. What do you want? I want to help you out. I was thinking about Chuck E. Cheese. Oh, God. Hear me out. Your payouts were in cash. That's illegal. When you play games at Chuck E. Cheese, you win tickets. Those tickets are traded for prizes. That's legal. You just need to do the same thing. People play your machines. Now, the credits they win get exchanged for stuffed animals. Then you buy those stuffed animals back for cash. No laws broken, and you're back in business. That's the stupidest thing I ever heard. What about George's idea? You think that grown-ups are gonna gamble for some stuffed animals? Yeah, that you're buying back from them. A teddy bear's only worth a couple of bucks. It's worth whatever you say it's worth. They win a hundred bucks and it's worth a hundred bucks. It seems I owe you an apology. Come on in. <laughs> 